recently appointed Washington County Commissioner Woody Spong uh, purportedly made inappropriate comments to Board of Education President Donna Brightman, and she has publicly called him out on it. Is Ms. Brightman overreacting or is Spong a Donna somewhere from the old boys club? Who should be removed from office? Bob, what do you think? You know something, I, uh, oh, a couple things. I don't know whether removed from office or, or taken off the list for confirmation or whatever is, is the right choice to be the one I would make, but I don't know if it's the right one or not. Um, you know, and as you said in your intro, you know, this isn't 1950s back room with cigar smoke and, you know, having a whiskey, uh, you know, two fingers whiskey uh, on the rocks with your buddies and, and, and just having a general discussion about money. Yeah, let's have a little this is, this here. is a professional setting by a professional individual speaking to another professional individual and saying things such as, you know, numbers are like whores. Once you get them on their back, they'll do anything you want them to do. That's just, that's just wrong. Yeah. Okay. I mean, in this day and age, it's just wrong. You know? I mean, if anybody, believe me, and my mom will tell you, and she'll, she'll attest to this, my <laughs> wife too, and probably 900 other people. But I, in my younger days, you know, had a sailor's mouth. And, um, you know, but what I've learned with age is that there are places that are appropriate to say things that you normally wouldn't say in other places. Unfortunately, Woody is a lot older than me, and he hasn't learned that yet. Well, it shows also an astounding political deafness to stand in front of somebody like Donna Brightman, who is extremely professional, mm -hmm. cool, yes, and say something like that. Well, I think, you, like you don't know your audience, let alone you know the inappropriateness of it to begin with. It also shows a certain lack of judgment, of judgment there, which would make me wonder about even you know stuff going on in the you know the political sphere, whether he really has the talent well, and, for this. Yeah. You know, it, it is a lack of, it is a lack of judgment, uh, I think, awareness. ultimately, and I agree with both of you yeah. guys, you know, and I, I think back, I certainly would never claim to be someone blessed with an angelic mouth when mm -hmm. I am in certain settings with yeah. my friends or at home or okay. what have you. And so, you know, I, I certainly mm -hmm. won't, won't take that, the high road on that. Well, but Shine you know, on your head's not a halo. You, know, you learn, <laughs> it's just, <laughs> okay, <boldness>. Bob. <laughs> Uh, he needed to have said, the wax. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. I'm just saying. That's what he needed to have said. He didn't just say, I'm right, just saying. Right. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but he didn't, so he's politically inappropriate. Good, now. Colin, I'm sorry. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, my, my only point being, you know, my son got in trouble when he was younger because, let's say, early elementary school for, for saying things that he had heard in conversation yeah, yeah. and repeating them. And he learned that lesson when he was in second grade, not to, you know, there are things that are appropriate to say at yeah. home and things that are not appropriate to say in a public environment. And I, especially not knowing somebody, it's okay yeah. if you've had a long working rapport with somebody and yeah. you're, you know, more, it's less of a formal setting, then certainly yeah. you know how far that boundary can go. And the relationship that two people can have can vary greatly depending on the personalities of yeah. the two people. And I agree with you, with you, Tom. It's 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 just unprofessional, and it, that makes you question. Yeah. Well, you know, the Woody and Woody believes that it's retribution uh, well, because really, of, yeah. of, of of leading the charge to not transfer the 4.4 million from the Undesert Native Reserve Fund for the Hub Project. Well, that's it, what he's claiming. Well, you know? it, it might it might show a bit of his his attitude toward the school board and what he thinks of the school board. Just well, just obviously, you think that. to me, it's just simply it's inappropriate and. Stupid. And it's retribution for speaking with your <laughs> foot in your mouth. Yeah. So, is it, is it grounds for him to get in trouble for it? Well, I, you know what? I, I, and and I want to tell you, you know, one Senate, of the right? things that, yeah. right, right, he's got to be confirmed by the Senate. Um, one of the things that I did see in, in reading some of the reports in the paper and everything was that we even have other county commissioners like Leroy Myers who, who says it's not just this issue, it's other issues that he's had concern about with Woody. Uh, so, you know, I don't know. I mean, it depends on who's going to push against our delegation and say, listen, this is the wrong guy, okay? That's all there is to it. Um, you know, he, uh, uh, when, when he was interviewed one time for an article that he did, he talked about how he was the only person other than Bill McKinley who actually understands Washington County government and politics in Washington County. Yeah. And in the same breath said, well, you know, uh, Campbell Soup over in Martinsburg, not Procter Gamble, 
You know, so I'm thinking to yeah, myself, yeah. really, you're the only person who knows about politics in Washington County. Yeah, well, okay. when his name was brought up to begin with, people said, who is this guy? I, yeah, yeah, I was like. Now I, we know. I do know that at one point, point you know, yeah, at one point in time, he, 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 he was part of Leadership Hagerstown. Uh, yeah. He was the executive director of Leadership, of Leadership Hagerstown. I don't remember interacting with him, so really, if I did, he left no impression on me. Um, this has left an impression on me, yes. I can guarantee you. And <coughs> the last time that I checked, the only time that you had to talk to your attorney was you were wrong. Right. <laughs> I mean... Well, yeah, that says an awful lot by yeah. itself that he's, you know, he yeah. talked to my attorney. Yeah, well, yeah, I'm, uh, you well, know, I'm, apparently... I'm, I'm fashioning a response with my attorney. Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah, you know what your response should have been, Woody, just no. in case you didn't know what it is? Donna. I'm sorry. I'm, Man, sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm stupid, I'm dumb, yeah, I'm that was sorry, that was it was wrong of me, and... You know, I can only hope that you can forgive me and we can move on in a professional yeah. way. Yeah. Although he does seem to have a pretty in involved personal knowledge of what happens with money transactions in Ladies of the Night. He does. <laughs> he does do that. Yes, he does, yeah, you know. So, yeah, and, um, know, so. you know, that was... No. You know, and apparently he raised some eyebrows with some of the other people who were present, even if they don't know exactly what was said. It was mentioned, well, at least reported, yeah, when yeah, they were and asked. You know what, and so, there's... And there's rumor of, in, in, rumor, okay, yeah. speculation, all that kind of stuff of things that uh, when, when he was in certain powers and position early in, in his career that he was maybe have said some inappropriate things, did some inappropriate things. I, I don't know. Maybe, again, like I said, maybe, maybe abs, you know, power corrupts absolutely. I don't know. But. Yeah, well, I think, you know, uh, Serafini and the people there in the Senate are going to have to consider whether it is an appropriate. He was appointed. Mm -hmm. I mean, we didn't elect him in Washington right. County, no, so no. so I think it's 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 fair to bring up this. I don't want to just you know drive the guy down, but however, he is in the public. Oh, and ultimately, discourse. one would so, like to think that the Senate will make a consideration based on a number yeah. of criteria and factors, and this yeah. should play into it. It should. Oh, yeah. part of it. it should be not yeah. exercising some sort of thought into what you say in a public setting or into a, in a professional setting. Well, play what, into what, do you, what do you think the Washington County public is going to, uh, to think of it, make of it? I mean, do, do you think we really care as, as voters, as, as a public? Well, I'll tell you, some of them do. I've yeah. already spoken to a few, of yeah. course, women especially, and some of them, they do yeah, care. This isn't Hillary Clinton's emails, okay? This. okay? I yeah. mean, this is Woody Spong mm -hmm. in Washington County. Yeah. You know, it's we're not Donald uh, Trump. No. Right, right. This, no. is, this is not, you know, you know, I can see Bernie Sanders standing up there now saying, we're tired of hearing about Spong's damn whores, you know, <laughs> or something like that. But, yeah, that, that yeah, would really I mean, calm things down. Yeah, 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 yeah. there's, there's a, again, this, this is just, uh, and, and I, I honestly believe this is probably the tip of an iceberg, if you want to know the truth about it. Mm -hmm. uh, so I, I would certainly hope that uh, the Republican Central Committee is already thinking Searching. about, well, yeah. okay, who yeah. might we send down what next name we might send down um, and although and, and you know what I, I don't I don't know how this confirmation thing I mean I know the con the, the Senate has to con has to confirm mm -hmm. me but I'm not sure that the governor just can't say no we don't okay. we, we take that name back we want some other name I don't know that he can't do that well Bob so. once again you got the last words so congratulations on that yeah, <laughs> that's a streak that's right it is. stay tuned the last call is next